In the hushed whispers of the night, have you ever felt the presence of the unseen? It's a sensation that has echoed through time, the inexplicable desire to communicate with what lies beyond our perception. Let the veil of time lift as we delve into the intriguing history of talking to the unseen. In the misty epochs of human history, our ancestors first grappled with the mysteries of the unseen. From the ancient caves of Lascaux to the stone circles of Stonehenge, traces of their attempts to reach out to the invisible world are etched in stone and pigment. They danced, they chanted, they offered sacrifices, all in an attempt to commune with the spirits they believed inhabited the earth, the sky, and everything in between. As time marched on, the Egyptians took this a step further, crafting elaborate tombs and intricate rituals to guide the departed souls to the afterlife. They believed in the power of words, inscribing spells and utterances on tomb walls, a testament to their faith in the unseen. The Greeks and Romans too held elaborate ceremonies to commune with their pantheon of gods and goddesses, beseeching them for favors or appeasing their wrath. The Oracle of Delphi, in her enigmatic trance, was said to be the mouthpiece of Apollo, delivering cryptic messages from beyond the veil. Fast forward to the Middle Ages, the era of witch trials and persecutions. The fear of the unseen was palpable, and yet there were those who dared to converse with what lay beyond. Mediums, seers, fortune tellers, they were the bridge between the living and the unseen, often paying a heavy price for their abilities. The 19th century brought a wave of fascination with the occult. Seances became the talk of the town, with the Fox sisters leading the charge in America. Tables tilted, knocks echoed, and messages from the other side were spelled out, captivating audiences and skeptics alike. Yet with the advent of the 20th century, the scientific lens began to scrutinize these practices. Parapsychology emerged, attempting to study the unseen and the interactions with it under the rigorous standards of science. Today, in the 21st century, talking to the unseen has evolved yet again. From EVPs in ghost hunting to quantum theories about parallel universes, we continue our age-old quest to understand and communicate with the unseen. So, we've journeyed through time, from the ancient caves to the modern laboratories, exploring mankind's enduring fascination with the unseen. We've witnessed the evolution from primitive rituals to complex seances, from persecuted witches to respected parapsychologists. Talking to the unseen, a practice as old as humanity itself, continues to evolve, continuing to draw us in with its blend of mystery, fear, and fascination. It is a testament to our persistent curiosity, our innate desire to understand the universe and our place within it. And so the conversation with the unseen continues, echoing through the corridors of time. We reach out, we listen, and perhaps, just perhaps, the unseen whispers back.